While a focus of the Biden administration has been getting people back to work, a new report shows about 4 million Americans quit their jobs in April of this year. The Bureau of Labor Statistics says that that is the highest quit rate since the agency started publishing this data more than 20 years ago. And millions more have said that they plan to quit their jobs in the near future. For more on this, I want to bring in social psychologist Dr. Ron Friedman. He is the author of Decoding Greatness, How the Best in the World Reverse Engineer Success. Dr. Friedman, what's your advice to people who have been quitting their jobs and trying to launch a new career right now? My advice is that there is a faster way to learn new skills. And so the traditional story is that when success comes from finding your talent or practicing for 10,000 hours, but there's a different approach. And that approach involves finding great examples in your field, whether it be a well-written memo, a phenomenal presentation, and then working backward to figure out how it was created. Reverse engineering turns out to be the path to figuring out great ideas in a faster way. Well, many companies have tried unsuccessfully to rehire workers who they laid off last year due to the pandemic. What can be done by companies to attract these workers back? Well, obviously, people want uh, a nice salary, but it's more than that. When it comes to success at work, there are three basic human psychological needs that people want in order to have a fulfilling experience at work. Those three psychological needs are the need for competence, feeling like you're good at what you do and feeling like you're growing at your at your job, feeling connected to others in a me and having meaningful relationships, and then feeling like you have some choice in how you go about doing your job. So when organizations do a better job of fulfilling people's psychological needs, they tend to have workers who are healthier, happier, and more productive. Well, with all of these employees quitting their jobs, uh, what changes do employers need to make in order to attract new job applicants moving forward? Well, one thing they need to do is they need to do a better job of providing people with positions that allow them to grow at work. That's what people really want when it comes to a job that gives their life meaning. And so creating growth opportunities and finding better ways of integrating both work and life. If this pandemic has taught us anything, is that this barrier that we have between work and life is brittle. And so what we really need from our workplaces is workplaces that provide not just balance, but really empower us to do a better job both at work and at home. All right. Dr. Ron Friedman, thank you. Thank you.